And sorry, I didn't realize you were on the way. Mm, what do I want to use? I think I want to keep up with the water spout. The water spout rapid spin. What is his ability? Pokemon's at half HP or less. Attack and special attack are increased. Okay. Oh, actually, um... Blue, are you in a jungle? No, wait, wait, wait. Let me jungle. Let me jungle. I was only gonna join if you need a fifth. We do. We do. We queued up with four. Tales of Arise? I've never really played the Tales games. Have I played Blastoise before? Yes. Um, the other day, one day for like an hour. All right, let me jungle, because I know Slowbro ain't jungling, and you guys got some baller ass lanes without me. I just want to see how the old shit. I should have ran Fluffy Tail. It's okay. Well, yeah, Blast has been out for like a week or two. I think, I think, I think. Ready? Go! Ghost on the Tail series? I believe you, but like, what are they like? Are they RPGs? That worked out. Oh, that stuns. Okay, both the things, both the, his starting moves stun and knock those guys. He's not a bad jungler. He's not a bad jungler. If I ran Fluffy Tail, this clear time would have been immaculate. Okay, they backed off. Come about. If Slowbro lives. Damn. We still got a decent take from that. Well, bro's under level. Top side's dying. Gonna get my levels. Final Fantasy really has a crazy collection. Really has a crazy collection of just some solid ass games. Like, not all of them are hits, but for how many Final Fantasy games there are for that many of them to be good. Not even good, some of them are considered like some of the best games ever. You know what I mean? 7, 9, 10, all have like rave reviews. We're gonna, we're gonna go bop. We're gonna go bot side. Really sick move combo. for this, but... Oh my god, they're so low! 
Damn. Fucking Mime stole it. Oh, that's so upsetting. We would have hit nine off that. We would have hit nine and we would have team wiped him, but now the opposite happens. Fucking Mime stole it. Damn. I think we... Mm, we don't lose off that. This game just gets really hard. Fuck! Please die. All right, could be worse. We actually kind of won that exchange up top. Our slow bro's pissed. <laughs> Our slow bro tried to steal my jungle and failed. Because he's died a lot and hasn't gotten any levels and he's pissed. And then I came in and actually took my jungle. So he tried to FF. He walked in and died and tried to FF. That's why we need the fifth. So wait, if you're still here, we kind of need the fifth. Okay, I have ultimate. I'm probably just going to go in there and use it. Still alive, don't know how. Did we get Dreadnought? I don't think we got Dreadnought, I think we all died here. I cannot believe he lived. He walked out of there with zero HP. It's weird that our slow bros this mad. <clears throat> We're not even doing that bad all in all. I mean, I haven't gotten any points off and that sucks. Yeah, he tried to steal my shit right there. If he flanks here, we're good, but I don't think I can rely on him to do anything. Oh, I guess instead of doing that, he did nothing. I felt like I was the only one attacking Mime right there. That was strange. I wanted to kill Mime and then get my 40 points off, but I felt like nobody else was attacking Mime. I got killed by nothing. All right, never mind. Sitting in the car for three hours waiting on my mom? Yikes. I hope it's over soon, Crimson King. Sounds like an ADC player. Oh, that's the thing. Is Slowbro supposed to be in a, su a support? So you, you would think he would know what he was signing up for. But now he's just trying to steal jungle camps and FF over and over again, so it's... It's a bold strategy, I'll give him that. Oh no, I only have 21! I thought I still had 50, but I died, I forgot. As long as we don't all walk in one at a time and die here, we'll be okay.
¿Sí? Uh, this is the only match we've done so far, Bron. And our fifth is a real shithead for some reason. He tried to steal my jungle camp, and I stopped him. He tried to steal my jungle camp, and I stopped him. And then ever since then, he's been inting and trying to forfeit on repeat. a cat right outside my door. I can hear it meowing. And I know it can hear me. Let him in. I could. You want me to? Me? Did you get locked in? Come here. There's stuff on your face. Come here. No, you got dust on your face. Jimmy, come here. Jimmy. I know you know how to jump, Bardo. Gimme. Gimme. He knows how to jump, but he won't do it in here. It's a cat. It's not my cat. It's not my cat. Sometimes when my mom's cat gets locked out of my mom's house, he'll come over here to me. I don't live very far away from my family. Come here. Come here. Come up here. Oh my goodness. Come here, Lardo. This is the fattest cat I know. All right. Oh my god, you're filthy. Oh my god, my shirt's filthy. Alright, get out. Let's go. All right, sorry about that. I heard him outside. I, kn I knew it was him right away. I was like, oh, shit. I'm going to turn my ear back on. Um, Braun or Wait, if anybody, if anybody wants to join, whoever wants to join, we got a fifth slot up. We do need a fifth. Or Mark. I miss having cats. I will say, I'm a dog person, 100%, all the way through. Um, cats are a lot easier to maintain. Because dogs, like, you gotta go take your, you gotta take your dog for fucking walk, like, daily. You know? Or he's, like, they're gonna be all over your shit. Dogs will chew shit up. Cats chew shit up, too. Cats get into stuff they're not supposed to, but it's like... Cats? 
Make sure they're fed, make sure they're clothed, make sure they have toys. And you gotta clean up some throw up every now and again. I'm pulling up, pulling out the crustle, hell yeah. I might, if it's okay with you guys, I think I'm gonna keep trying to jungle Blastoise. If no one else does, uh, does, I will, but I'm not that great. Okay, wait, if you're not that high of a rank, probably not, just because we got a lot of high level players and we're gonna be against high level players. Have you seen flying squirrels? Funny story, I kind of looked into getting a flying squirrel for a while. I wanted the most exotic pet that wasn't like a, a huge bitch to maintain. And flying squirrels and sugar gliders look like they fit the role. That's cat. Yeah, I should have stretched him out for the camera, but he was filthy. He was getting dirt all over me. Um, but Yemi, that's my mom's cat, is huge. When she found that cat in her backyard, he was six months old, but he looked like he was two months old. And he was skin and bones. The cat had been, don't know where his mom was, nothing had been feeding him. That cat was left to starve. And ever since my mom took him in and gave him an unlimited food bowl, that cat never, that cat never once looked back. He got fat as fuck and stayed there. I get to veteran. I would try to make sure you got to ultra, but yeah. Okay, three people in my chat are current having currently having a fight on who doesn't have to play with us right now. What up, water? Oh, all I can eat bed. Yeah, and he knows it. He'll let you know if the food bowl is empty. That food bowl cannot be empty for a second. My friend Basil once brought one of his sugar gliders to a convention. It was hidden inside his shirt pocket. Yeah, it's badass, right? Apparently flying squirrels and sugar gliders are both like that. They'll just hang out on you. And if they do come out to play, they'll like sit on your shoulder or climb around you, but they don't like to go very far. Okay, Mark, the only rule is I'm Jungle Blastoise. Figure everything out amongst yourselves. I'm Jungle Blastoise. Only problem with sugar gliders, Alan. That feels like a solution to me. I'm nocturnal. Oh, chat was arguing over which one of them didn't have to come in here and uh, be our fifth man and unite was all. Oh, I don't get bonuses for playing Blastoise anymore. I feel like I played one Blastoise game. I mean, today, yeah, but I'm overall. The Jungle Stoice is coming out. I don't like spiders, but I love tarantulas. They all deserve death. If I could somehow eliminate... I, I think if given the choice, I would eliminate most bugs from the ecosystem if it wouldn't, like, fuck it up. Mosquitoes? Guaranteed. If science could come far enough, we could buy an engineer, bioengineer some shit that just eliminated every mosquito ever. 100%. In a heartbeat. I don't hate spiders, but if bugs, if other bugs are gone, we don't need spiders either. Because the reason I don't hate spiders is because they take out other bugs. Blastoise looks like a unit. Blastoise is in fact a unit. People were saying he was really good. The first couple games I played with him, I didn't feel it, but... I'm starting to think with this rapid spin stuff, he's not all bad. 
Wham. Whew, got him. Got him, last hit. See, he's got a good clear time. I think Fluffy Tail helps a lot. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Their eject buttons are up. Okay, well we pop two eject buttons. Ooh, kill him! Damn it, I was one auto, man! Fucking shit. I really thought we were gonna get that. Dino? Wait. I'll be having that. Surely this that was like surely this Ninetales isn't following me. Okay, I'm gonna make my route to where it takes me topside, but it's gonna take me like a minute, okay? You guys can hear me. Oh no, it pushed me back. There's a load of barnacles. Oh, I'm coming. I hit level 8 off this, but I'm coming. There we go. Oh, we gotta go bot side soon. Yeah, you know what? The rapid spin combo might be kind of nasty with it. We gotta go bot side. Damn, I almost hit level 9. I don't know what this company's fetish with tanks and supports doing more than they should, yeah. I also hate that. Ooh, level 9, that's big. You guys aren't going to believe this, but we got a fifth, and all of a sudden we're kicking ass. Man, if you don't fucking mind, let me just put a 40 bomb in here. Alright, boys. Looking good. Kakaratu, do you have a Switch? Have you thought about picking up Pokemon Unite? Since it probably wouldn't be as hard on your hands as a keyboard in League. And Louis stole Rotom. Oh, we're living. All we needed was a competent fifth. Look where look where we are now. Oh shit. Hey contents, am I dead? Uh yeah. Good dunk, but uh I'll dunk too. And then I'll take my lead. Later, nerds. All right, good work, everyone. Back to farming. How did I know it would be Mark?
rapid spin's kind of good. All right, level twelve. Have ultimate. Come on, bot side. The shell waddle's killing me. He's got a little waddle. Got a little waddle with it. We're doing it! We're doing it! Go get this bitch. Oh fuck, he has ult. Uh, he triple kills us. Or not. Ooh, you know what's crazy? The, uh... The combo me and Louie have. The rock slide water spot combo from the sky is actually nuts. Frosty Flame, thank you for the one year, man. How you doing? I'll be having that. Yo, are we killing a fucking Venusaur? Because I'll kill a fucking Venusaur. Ain't bug me none. Alright, I will also run away and tear as uh, we get our asses kicked. Ain't above that either. Is that a guard chomp? It is. Garchomp, Wiggly Tough slanking you. You might want to run away. Let me get these double buffs. Got my ult for this. I'm not going to hit 14 before 15 seconds is up. They need Zapdos, we don't. Now, I'm going to do a play that is... It's known in the States, in the southern part of the States, is stupid. Yep, there it is, okay. Snorlax is holding. I figured I would go up and try to dunk, and then i get jumped by ten of them. Am I dead? I have ult. I can't die when I have ult. Okay, I got like three ultimates off him just now. If you guys just show up in the middle, we win. Oh, never mind. We didn't show up in the middle. What a goal. What a goal. What a goal. That's depressing. I was hoping my attack would be frequent enough. Ninetales couldn't dunk for free. Okay, 100% chance I get stopped here, but if I don't, we still win the game. Wow, get a life. Literally begging you losers to get a life. Yeah, everybody's playing defense even though they all scored 100 points just now. And none of them have anything left to put up on us. So we just, yeah, we lose. That's a spirit breaker. I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. I went mid when Zapdos came up, and I know Louis was putting up 100 up top, but nobody else was mid. And then I got three of them to put all their ults on me, and as long as anybody responds, we just show up and wash them in the middle for free. We literally just take Zapdos super free. Um, but instead of taking Zapdos super free, just nobody went mid after Louis put up 100 up top and I burned three ultimates. That was so strange.
That's a weird way to lose that one. That felt like we had a handle on everything the entire game, but then for some reason in the most crucial part when Zapdos is up at the most important part of the entire game, nobody was there. That one weirds me out. Yeah, I pulled the south off the top of my head. It didn't really have a reason behind it. I mean, it, it was it was just one of those things where it's weird. Where we played spectacularly for nine minutes and fifty seconds, but then there were ten seconds where we just threw the whole game at, around Zapdos, which is the only ten seconds you can throw a game at when you're winning by that much, by as much as we were. Right, I need one good game. I'll have that many points up. Little denim, 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 denim. Does anything look good under the denim? Not really. Yeah, I didn't like it either, Braun. I'd rather lose, I'd rather just give up uh, Rotom and make sure we get Dreadnought. I'm gonna jungle Blastoise one more time and then I'll probably kick off and play something else. You attack him straight, they still for Yeah, I feel like Zapdos might be better if it knocks him down to like one fourth of the time to dunk a ball instead of max. I don't know. I still stand by the problem doesn't have to be Zapdos. It's probably also double points, but. Louie, you running Fluffy Tail? Blastoise with a head. Yeah, if I like Blastoise more, I'd probably have the skin by now. I think it's the goals. I frames on goals is too much. You say that, but like, if double points doesn't exist in the last two minutes, then most of the games where they get Zapdos, they still don't beat us. I feel like getting rid of double points, like leave it with the insta goals, but. 250 points a lot of times if you've been shitting on them the whole time doesn't actually sway the whole battle and that's if they all have 50 and they all dunk because <clears throat> I still think this game does need an equalizer this game is very snowballing if you pick shit that shits on everybody in the first half Coming online late game doesn't matter unless you can get zapped those.
thought about doing the Surf Hydro Pumper out this time, but I just don't want to. Wow, do you think they saw me? They fucking cut and ran. Oh, there's three of them here. I don't know where they all went, but there was three of them. Oh my god, of course, he literally appeared from nothing. I'm dead. Nope, Louis saved me. Thank you, Louis. Damn, that was fucking close, too, man. I just wanted to get my points off. I feel like I've had a tough time scoring, like, at all these last few games. And by last few, I mean today's and then the last time we played. Like, I can still get the kills and do the stuff, but scoring doesn't come very frequent. For whatever reason. Alright, you gotta rotate bottom. We got Dreadnought up. I'm only level 7, that's gross. I didn't mean to take that. Ron needs this. Fuck it, let's do it. Near, did Slowbro literally appear? I'll just be here. Damn it, they got Dreadnought. Why are we top? Who is top? We just had a verbal discussion beforehand about how staying top behind for Rotom was a bad idea. Oh my god, I'm not level 9. Oh my god, I went in there thinking I was level 9. I just died for no reason. What is going on up here? Captain, think, uh, think of the sub, Captain. Did you make a new account? Is the discount still there for three to six months? What does that mean? What do you mean by this? I'm here. They all ran away. Okay. Well. Yeah, we literally had, before this game started, we literally had an out loud discussion. Hey, when Dreadnought's up, literally everybody go bot for Dreadnought, because keeping one person behind is stupid and loses his Dreadnought and most likely loses us the game. And then somebody's Garchomp stayed back to get Rotom and dunk like 40 points instead of getting Dreadnought. After we had a whole ass conversation about it. I am confused.
<laughs> what an ult. What an ult by the Stoice right there. I don't know if you guys saw that ult or not, but, uh... Wow, what a what a crazy ultimate by the Blastoise just now. Did anybody catch that? I did. Uh, Captain V2, what did you mean by the discount still there? Cinderace is fucking dead as fuck. Okay, Blastoise might actually be strong. I'm... My initial assessment may have been incorrect. Blastoise might actually be pretty fucking strong. Subscription discount? Okay, so did you sub for three to six months? And the discount pulled, pulled up? Is that what's happening? Okay, my ult's up. I just want this buffer zap, though. We're gonna be full health. Zap those, fellas. I don't know what- that was weird, man. My ult just glitched out. Whatever, got that. Those won the game. Who cares? Won the game. My ult glitched out. I kind of did it, but didn't. And then it knocked itself down to 93% and came back in a minute. When the Blastoise? Blastoise got added like two weeks ago. But people have been bitching about him since the game came out because he's in the tutorial. You battle him in the tutorial, not Blastoise specifically. You, be, you battle War Turtle in the tutorial. So they knew this Pokemon existed. And then a Pokemon Direct happened before Blastoise came out. And uh, they announced Sylveon and Mammoth Swine, but they didn't say shit about Blastoise. Sylveon's not in this yet. Sylveon got announced at the last direct. So soonish, Sylveon and Mammoth Swine are going to be in this. But yeah, so people kept waiting. They're like, oh yeah, Blastoise will probably be the first Pokemon. Because he, I think he might have also been in the beta. I'm not sure. And... He's in the tutorial, so everyone's like, yeah, Blastoise, any day now. The other two starters are in it, Blastoise got to be on the way, and then they're like, all right, everybody, Guard of War. And I'm like, oh, okay. But Blastoise soon, though, right? And they're like, all right, everybody, here comes Blissey. And they're like, all right, but Blastoise, and they're like, direct coming out. The next Pokemon are going to be Sylveon and Mamoswine. And they're like, but Blastoise? And then the next week, they're like, oh, yeah, by the way, Blastoise in the game right now. And they just put Blastoise in the game. This is a new account. My old account's kind of gone for a long time. I can't count this account as new or old. What happened to your other account? That game was weird. That game was a strange one. Because it's like, once we came on, we just steamrolled them.
I would be fans if I played this. I can't blame them. It was just, their struggle was funny. All for, at the end of the day, Nintendo to be like, oh yeah, he's in the game right now, by the way. Just turn your turn your console on, he's there. Forgot the email and password. Oh no, Batman. Okay, uh, if anybody else wants to play Blastoise, I'm off Blastoise. Let me check and see what all I'm looking for in terms of Battle Pass stuff. I am going to stay in jungle, though. That's chill, chap. Uh, I just need more points and MVP again. And to knock out a few more Pokemon. I got reported. What did I do to them? I didn't report you. This game have cross-platform? Yes to phones. That's out now, right? That came out in the beginning of September. But it's literally just this and phones, so. Lotus, your weave discussion last night inspired our weave discussion, and we just talked about weave shit for like a like an hour 15 when the uh, stream started up today. I wanted you to know that. September 22nd, okay. Yeah, it's supposed to be cross-play with phones, but I'm, I'm gonna be 100% honest with you guys. If y'all are on phones, I'm not trying to play with you. I'm not trying to play with you on my team. You can play on the other team because you're gonna be on a phone. It's gonna be funny, but... Hadn't weaved in a cool minute. Lotus, get on a weave cake with me. I know you're already like leagues ahead of me in terms of the weed department and all that, but get on a weed stick with me. Okay, I'm gonna drop Buddy Barrier. Floatstone maybe? Or maybe I do run Buddy Barrier. Ah, fuck it, let's do Floatstone. The One Piece eight seasons, and you gave him a hundred episodes just cause, and come to find out, that's that's one season. Yo, all starter squad, all starter plus Blissey, let's go. Rick, thank you for getting the sub to Lotus. I was going to come to you for anime recommendations when I finished up Demon Slayer, but now I realized I want to watch Fire Force, the Demon Slayer movie in Assassination Classroom, so I'm set for a little while. I'm also only on episode 10 of Demon Slayer, so I got... Seven bangers. Did Charizard get buffed? No, I'm pretty sure he's still garbage. I'm pretty sure Charizard's still fucking dog water. But I like playing him. He's not that bad when you take him in the jungle because he gets to be Charizard really fast. Charizard's a physical attacker, not a special one, right? Charizard's only good when jungling. You're using the term good very loosely right now. He does jungle fast, though. I like taking Flamethrower or Fire Blast because it's more fun. I'll try those this time. I'll get to the bottom of this. Oh yeah, I guess I will need a funny sub. I probably will watch that Station Classroom in dub. That'll be something. Alright, let's see what this flamethrower business is all about. Alright, well, I fucked up.
Yeah, I want to do a subathon. I don't know what I want to do in it yet. Um, I might try to like have a le legitimate conversation with my friends and see if I can work out a day where a lot of them can be there to just play squad games. Because it's a lot easier for me to stream for long periods when squad games, and it's also one of Chad's favorite things that happens on the stream. So. I don't like how underleveled I feel right now. I'm coming. I think Lucario might just be legitimately fucking busted. And Lucario might just actually be snapped and nobody's talking about it for some reason. Oh, good. Fucking the crab snuck in with his tiny body and... Sneaky frame. Yeah. Alright. This one's on me, fellas. I threw. I played Charizard, and if you play Charizard, you literally have to play perfect in the beginning, or you fall so far behind, you'll never recover. And uh, I did not play perfect. I died twice. Let's see what Fire Blast Flamethrower is all about. Got Dreadnought coming up, fellas. Okay, Fire Blast is big fire spin. Got it. Dreadnought, fellas. The bot lane. He's level 9. Yeah, we're cooked. I'm dying on spawn. We're cooked. Did, look, did they come out with a patch I didn't know about? Bronze 5? Yeah, no, we're fucking done, skis. Oh no, I get it. I tried to walk. I'm dead. Y'all fu y'all fucking won. Lucario has infinite dash and infinite shields, infinite damage. I fucking got it. If Lucario got a nerf, it was in a patch not that long ago that I didn't hear about. Wait, we got Dreadnought? I thought they already got it. What'd y'all do? Oh my god, look, th this is this is the kind of team I need in every game I play. Because these guys are making up for my shortcomings and my failures. Yawn, are you good? Wigglytuff, where are we going? Yeah, fucking run. Get the fuck out of here, dunk. This is the kind of team I need every single game. Every single game, I play in everything ever. Where I have a bunch of shortcomings and I fuck up a lot, and my team just makes up for my shortcomings by being good. They just, they're like, nah, you're good, we got you. And then I get got, but in a good way. Yawn, if you're talking about overrated in terms of Pokemon in general, sure, I guess. But if you're talking about overrated in this game, in this game, Charizard sucks ass. In order to put fire spin on their base, it's kind of nice. Bitch. Bitch. Please dunk, please dunk, please dunk. Oh, we're cooked. Am I stuck? How long am I stuck for? Oh, I just couldn't move. I thought my controller died. No, I see you, Yon. I got you. 
I thought you were attacking me for being a Charizard player at first, and I was like, well, don't attack me because he's OP. Attack me because he's dog shit. Fuck. I got there zero seconds late. And this stupid fucking flower body blocked me. What a bitch. To assume that I took fire spin as a Charizard. The audacity. Good shot, Blaster. Oh, Blastoise just 1v1 Cinderace up top. If I get up there before they do. Cinderace died and I backed at almost the same time. And Cinderace spawned in one second after me. If you want to know how poorly this game's programmed. Charizard's so fucking bad. <laughs> Cook, surely. Surely the burn kills Wigglytuff right there. Surely Wigglytuff being a half HP and then me ult flamethrowering fire blasting auto attack and kills Wigglytuff. No, Wigglytuff walked out just fine. Okay then. Yeah, they all just rotated a Rotom way better than we did, which isn't anything new. What a goal! I will joke. Yeah, that's gotta be a joke. You cannot be out here saying that Charizard's overrated, but Jolteon's the best Pokemon. Jolteon gets Jolteon gets a bunch of love. Well, it feels like for no reason sometimes. Oh shit, Zap does it up. He damn near could have killed them there. Uh, Blissey is level 10. We're so much lower than they are. I love that that tank one-taps me. That tank literally one-tapped me. I full combo a Wigglytuff at half HP and Wigglytuff lives just fine, but that fucking the goddamn rock crab walks up and one-touches me and I die. MVP Brawn. MVP Brawn! Nobody's going to get their dunks off. I think we still lose. Turn around. Turn around. Don't let Braun score 100. Turn around. Don't let Braun score 100. Turn around. Don't let Braun score 100. Turn around. Don't let Braun. Who oh, the fuck? What are you doing? You're putting up nine. You're running over there to put up fucking nine. We lost the game off that. We lost it. All right, that dude, that dude's out of here. <laughs> that dude's out of here, man. What the fuck am I supposed to do with that? Venusaur had nine fucking points. And then he went over there, and instead of dunking any points, he went over there and died. Instead of dunking any points, he went over there and died. How did you get Ultra? You have to be making that up. Guy in chat said he was Ultra. I guess I never checked. Holy shit. Instead of instead of turning around and preventing 100 points from going up, he ran forward and died. We lo we probably been losing cuz your dog shit. Fucking cannot understand the thought process on that one. Holy shit. Because you're the dude who's been hanging out up top. You're the guy who's been hanging out up top while we, like, try to fight for Dreadnought, and then you go do nothing up top around Rotom. In lighter news, I'm loving JJK. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I can't score any points in these godforsaken games. Oh, 
Ultra means nothing, apparently. I thought that was when people got to the rank I could start to, like, respect a little bit. I didn't even know I had these. They still had a hunter on us. You understand that if, if you are alive and we turn around and kill Lucario, we have a chance to score again. And you can put up more than 9 points. 18 points, whatever it would have been. If you turn around and stop Lucario and we kill Lucario, there's still a chance we go score. So not only do they not put a hundred on us, we can also score more, and that wins us the game. But instead, you, with nine points, watching me kill the goal, knowing you had to run further, decided with nine points, you were going to run forward and die. That decision-making process is not one that can be trusted. I can't do the Ming Green Sandals. Fucks up the whole fit. All right. I think I need. I think I need points. Or was I good? I don't need to do the whole do your 12 missions thing. Yeah, I need 30 more points. We're gonna do one more battle. Oh, I need 30 more points and like five more kills, so. We gotta chance it with a rando. That was my fault. You know what? I shouldn't play Charizard. Charizard's just dog shit. If I really want to knock these last ones out, I may have to bust that all reliable. I gotta burn it back into my champ. Well, I don't know how your thought process would be, we're over 100 points down, so instead of me defending at all, I should just go die. I don't know, I don't follow that line of thinking either. Fucking pieces! What are you playing with Rando? Do your thing, Bron. Oh no, I might not have another water here. That's so sad. Ew, I have to lane. Oh, I feel like <clears throat> one of us needs Lou and the other one needs Blizzy. I don't think we can lane together. That lane would a lot of attacking and dying easy Ready, go. I haven't busted out the old my champ in a while. I might be bad on him. All right. Probably my bad, but I don't like that we just four-footed the Audino. We have to go harass them now, and we're not good at that. Nah, they're just a lot more equipped to fight early on than we are. We just kind of have to eat shit for a minute. They buffed flamethrower damage, fire punch, knockback, and lowered fire blast cooldown. I must not have seen the most recent patch note. Try to get a look at that. That's top lane going. All right, I didn't need four. Didn't want it. Fucking 
Hell. Oh, everything sucks. Oh boy took jungle so he could come feed our lane. Oh boy insta lock jungle so he could go to bot lane and die. Yeah, this is why I don't like not playing jungle because it just you get in a lot of these situations where you just can't do anything. What is he doing? He walked in bot and died again. Please just kill the slow bro. Please. For the love of God, I am never- He's level 7, man. He's level 7 because people will not get the fuck out of my lane. The jungler is just walking experience to him on repeat. What do I do here? If that patch was beginning of August, I probably did read it. And just didn't care because Charizard was still bad. I bet I saw that they were buffing the bad shit on Charizard and just didn't care. But if that's the last patch, I bet I am current on it. I'm level 5, I'm so fucking useless. Fucking Zorora has literally just spoon fed them experience out the ass. Please don't let them take that. Don't know what happened. Don't know what happened, I looked up, all my health was gone. Please just auto hurt, please just auto hurt. I'm begging you, I'm begging you, Zorora. For once in your life, do anything. They got Dreadnought in zero minutes, zero seconds. All right, get me out of this one. Do the move, 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 or die. We'll just die. I didn't want to do the move, actually. Let's just steal his jungle. I feel like it's a little late for anything now, but yeah. He's probably one of those guys who he'll see me doing it on the minimap and stop whatever he's doing to run all the way across it and prevent me from leveling up. They're firing off fucking ult, because of course they are. I'm level 7. I'm level 7, and I'm not getting levels from killing the jungle monsters either. Which is strange, because usually when you're this far down, the catch-up XP is big. Literally hate these kind of matches. Yeah, jungler, insta-lock jungle, walked into bot, died, walked into bot, died, walked into bot, died, we're out-leveled, I can't play the game. And it's not like I can it's not like I can be proactive in the beginning because we are a chancy Machop lane in the beginning. So obviously fucking Lucario lane is gonna shit on us. Lucario, whoever the fuck his teammate was, is just gonna dumpster us. So I can't like be proactive and go out and try to get a kill early. I have to hope that my jungler does something. And what my jungler did was walk in and die. It's second dreadnought, I'm still not level nine. How's Aurora doing? Oh, he died again. I cannot believe my ultimate didn't do the one HP of damage and needed to kill Dreadnought right there. Dreadnought would have been a huge turn. And then I ulted it, turned around, cross chopped it, and then ran in and punched it, and it didn't do the one HP. It took a fucking Blastoise ultimate. And now my ult's down, so I'm not gonna do anything.
If I just get like one or two more kills, I don't have to play another game after this. I think I need a few more points. What are you doing, man? You came up here to defend nothing. Your team was running away. Your team had already scored all their points and was running the opposite direction. You literally do not gain anything from coming up top unless you guess on the off chance the Machamp is trying to sneak 36 points. That's the only scenario where that's a positive play. It's just a regular Blastoise. Silver. This is what Blastoise looks like. Fucking move! Oh my god! Why is Blastoise gaining HP? Did you see me full combo him and his health went up? Oh, that's that stupid focus ban bullshit. I was so lost for a minute. I was like, okay, Blastoise has no health. There's my ultimate. There's my cross chop. There's my submission. Alright, his health has gone up. What happened? That should be enough where I don't have to play this game anymore. That should be enough points where I don't have to play this game anymore after this. Yeah, yeah, I know about the guard shot. Okay, so I've read the buff list. I must have just glossed over Charizard because I knew Charizard is still going to be ass what regardless. A what a goal! What a goal! What a goal! Five, four, three, two, one. Time's up. You lose. I wish this show death so bad. I bet Zorora died 40 times. I've never thought about how the... I've never thought about how bad the uh, lower death timers can actually hurt your team, too. Oh, no, Partless, how you doing? Because if somebody sucks ass, right? Like our jungler, for example. If somebody sucks ass and they die and they have a really low death timer, all he did was all he did was use that really low death timer to spawn in and die again. But because he's not getting any points and because he's not getting any kills and because he's not getting any levels, his death timer is still really low. So he would use that to spawn in and die again. And then spawn in and die again. If death timers were higher like they should be, he can't die nearly as often. I think I'm still missing one. Oh, I think I must have been one kill short. Yep, literally one kill short. All right, we have to do one more, and then I'm out of here. We would have been better off in a 4v5. We literally would have been better off 4v5 in that game. Can I join up? Are you booted up? Wait, if you want to get in, this is the last one we're doing. If you want to get in here, this is the last one we're doing. 
All you really need to know is that we rotate for Dreadnought when Dreadnought's up, so... 30 seconds before... Oh, Tino, you're here! Uh, we'll let Wade do it, though. <clears throat> um, you pretty much 4v5... No, no, no! If we actually 4v5, we would've had better chance. We would've had better odds. But instead of 4v5ing, we had a guy who was taking jungle farm, not doing anything with it, and then feeding experience to the other team. We literally would've had a better time in a legit 4v5. That was a 4v6. Anyway, wait, as long as you know that when you see Dreadnought timer happening, 30 seconds to Dreadnought, immediately rotate down to Dreadnought. That's where we're going. And then once Dreadnought plays over, we rotate up for Rotom. And that's mostly it. <clears throat> and I'm jungling, because oh my god. And then you have to ready up, basically. When we queue up, and then everybody's ready. That's, those are basically the only rules. How the other get most of them have been pretty bad. That last one was the worst by a lot, but most of them have been not good. But we had a guy who would hear us saying we, we had a guy who was playing from chat who would hear us saying, hey, don't do that consistently, and then he kept doing it, and it was that was kind of fucking us up for a little while too. Full heal. I don't see anybody running full heal. I, it's crazy how many eject buttons I still see. I can't blame him. It's just I would I wouldn't be upset if a jack button got nerfed again. Feels like the problem is that there's like. Half, maybe less, of the Pokemon feel like they need Eject Button. Like, you don't have, like, you literally don't have an escape with Venusaur without Eject Button, right? He needs Eject Button or he's fucked. And the more you nerf it, the more you nerf those Pokemon. And Venusaur's already not good. But then there's a huge chunk of Pokemon that only take Eject Button because it's still the best. Even though they don't need it. Like, my champ, you don't need it, my champ. I prefer Smoke Screen. Or Slow Smoke, whatever it is. New Pursuit, right? Oh my god, I haven't played Absol in so long. Very good attack! <laughs> that move flung me to the other side of the wall, what the fuck? Oh, where? Okay, that was that was crazy. Lucario was very clearly right below me, and instead of attacking right below me, Absol looked up and swung at nothing. Still first Devos in bot lane. We're, we're fucked. We are fucked once... I'm gonna go back into solo queue. I'm just gonna do my standard shit or my weeklies in solo queue. For some reason, whenever a group... I, like, it's it's always it's always cooked on group. It's the same way I had to get into a... Uh, master solo. Paid to win. Oh 
shit. Three of them came down here. All right, gotta start rotating for Dreadnought, boys. Probably better off saving for Mamus Swan. I imagine Mamus Swan's gonna be pretty decent. Off rip. Good stuff. This is the craziest tower dive I've ever seen. And it worked. And it worked. Mamus Swan should be fun. Mamus Swan and Sylveon both look interesting. Mamus Swan is one of those. I probably wouldn't pick Mamus Swan. Like, if you would have sat there and gave me a list of Pokemon that I would expect to come to unite, Mamus Swan probably wouldn't have came until after I named off 100 Pokemon. At least. Damn it. I didn't put my 30 in. Luckily, I paid to win, so I fear no man. Oh shit! He ulted. I didn't realize he'd ulted. They got him. They got him! I lost a lot of balls, which sucks, but... Whatever. Got my own back up, Dreadnaws up. Ult up for Dreadnaws big time. I like Mammoth Swan. Yeah, no, I, I like the idea that he's there. He's just not one I want to guess. He would have been very low on my guessing. Greninja did not die. Greninja didn't die off of an ult pursuit psycho cut auto crit. Color me surprised. Uh, very good pursuit. That's what pursuit does is it just fucking kills me, I guess. Oh, but then he dies off of one death. Good job, Blissey! You turned around and walked through a Blastoise. We're so proud of you. I should've gone top. I should've just backed thing on top. The good news is that they have Rotom for free now. They got a 2v1 up here. They lost Rotom! I'm going back in a solo queue. I'm going back in a solo queue for this shit, man. What do I, what do, I do? What do I do? What do I do here? Anybody come a bot? We're not? We're busy top not getting Rotom? Alright then. Suck, hey, what up, Jekyll? I think I'm 47. Smile less than three. We've all be badass, won't you? There's a, that's, a, that's what I'm saying. There's a lot of them you would have thought would have been in for Mammoth. And again, I'm not complaining about Mammoth. He's cool, he's unique, and nobody expected him.
All right, we need Zapdos or we lose the game. My oath! <laughs> Fucking a Blastoise and a Blissey can kill me before Blastoise's ult stops going off. A Blastoise and a Blissey. A tank and a support tank can kill you in the span of half of a second. Not damage dealers, the tanks. Whatever Pikachu did was stronger than my ult. Alright, get me out of here. I'm done with this game. I'm done with this game. Go next. Go next. We're just giving up shit for free. Giving up shit for free. What a goal. What a goal. Have we not? Okay. What a goal. You lose. Bold commentary, Heartless. Mammoth Swine sounds like defense. They kind of need more of that role, I think. How? Blastoise, Snorlax, and Crustle already do more damage than most of the damage dealers. What does what does making another defender that does a shit ton of damage do for the game? Yeah, I, uh... We had people on Zapdos. I ulted Zapdos, and whatever Pikachu did did more damage than my ult. Which is a real bummer. My weeklies also did not get me to level 70. That's rough. Oh, I'm gonna end up spending a thousand gems for this shit. 